today we're gonna take you through a 15 minute cardio jump rope workout. What's going on, JRD Nation? Brandon Epstein here from the Jump Rope Dudes to take you through this 15 minute workout today. So specifically, we're focusing on improving our cardio. And so to do so, we're gonna have longer intervals. So we're gonna do one minute long intervals. And we're gonna be using a lighter jump rope. And so while we do this, the key is to get your intensity high, very high, really bring your energy into this workout. Because if you do, you're gonna be able to increase your cardio capacity. So I wanna see everyone through the screen here. I'm gonna be watching you bring the heat. I know what you're thinking, this is a jump rope workout, so I'm gonna need a jump rope, and don't worry, got your back. Right here, we got the best jump rope in the world. This is the cross rope, and specifically, I'm gonna be using the quarter pound cross rope today, available in the Get Lean set. So if you want this jump rope, it is our favorite, and we find it to be the best jump rope for weight loss on the market. That's why we use it in all of our workouts. Obviously, we want the most bang for our buck when it comes to the effort we put into our workout. So if you want it, it's linked up in the description below, and you can get it by using the code do the thing and you'll get 10 percent off now for those of you who are looking for something more serious even beyond this work right here i highly recommend you check out our jrd 90 workout program we'll also link that up in the description below with a little discount that program is just a transformation program right so you can come here you can do these workouts with me and kind of do it without a structure and if that doesn't work for you then you can go into this 12-week regimented program that is designed to create jump rope transformation so if that's what you're interested in that's also linked up below. So that's all I have to say. Let's get into this workout. All right, JRD Nation, let's get started here with the regular bounce. We got one minute, follow along with me. Keep it nice and simple. We're gonna do one exercise per minute interval. Then we're gonna take a 15 second rest. We're gonna do it again. We're gonna do it again and again until we reach 15 minutes. So, a little bit non traditional. Some of you who do our other workouts or 30 second intervals, we take a minute rest between eight exercises. We're not doing that today. We're going minute exercise, 15 second rest. We're gonna do that for the full duration of the 15 minute workout. That's how we build our cardio. We're gonna push ourselves, increase our aerobic capacity. All right, I'll stop talking like that. <laughs> Let's get after it, guys. First exercise coming to an end here. Five, four, three, two, one, time. Hands up if you need. Deep breath into the nose, out through the mouth. To be honest with you guys, if you watched my workout from a few weeks ago, I said I was dealing with a little bit of sickness. I'm on some antibiotics right now, so have the best aerobic capacity, but a little 15 minute workout's a nice way for me to uh, move my body and hopefully you as well. And if you're feeling great today, I recommend you doing this workout two times. It'll be about 30 minutes total. All right, we're doing run in place here. Let's stand up on the balls of your feet and just get into your rhythm here. I would tell you're pushing yourself about 70% of your all out capacity. We're not going 100% because we're only doing, because we're doing these longer duration intervals. So we're really working on our cardio capacity instead of our more explosive bursts. Just want to say thank you guys so much for all the continued support. Dan and I are so grateful for this community. I gotta tell you, it's a long time coming. And by the time I'm shooting this video right now, Woo. We're about to hit a million subscribers this week. I'm sure by the time you're watching this video, we're already over a million subscribers, but that's a trip. We're grateful. It's all because of you guys doing the thing. Here we go. We're gonna do feet front to back. So basically, you're just alternating one foot front of the other, stand on the balls of your feet. And as you can see here, my hands are parallel to one another. Creates a very nice, smooth, skipping experience. And my elbows are in, arms jutting out to the side. You know, all the basics. If you need help with more basic jump rope form, we do have a free seven day beginner challenge. If you just go to jumpropedudes.com, put your name and email in there, we will send it to you for free. 
turn you into a jump rope ninja real quick. So there's always an option if you aren't new to this community. And for those of you who've been with us for a while, well, you know the deal. We're just staying consistent out here. We're not being fancy. We're just doing the thing. One thing Dan and I try to just promote and bring to you guys is like this relatability that, hey, you know, we're busy guys. We have a lot going on. I'm a new father. And these types of workouts just fit your busy life, right? 15 minutes here, 30 minutes there. We're going feet in and out now. Feet side to side, bring your feet together and out. And so you don't have to be a crazy athlete to stay lean all year and feel good. You just have to be consistent with these workouts five times a week. That's all it takes. Here at my condo, they have these tennis courts and during the day, no one uses them. So I get to work out here. <laughs> put my jump rope mat down it's perfect it's getting hard to talk as the workout goes on so what i want you guys to do is focus on just staying nice and light on your feet balls your feet bring your feet together and back out together and back out breath down during these brief rest periods. All right, next up, we're gonna take it to another level here. We're gonna do three regular bounces followed by a double under. You can't do a double under. Watch it twirl after this, but for now you can just do regular bounce. basics just to jump rope regular bounce here pick up the tempo a little bit more really use your wrist to speed up the rope see how the balls of your feet so part of this is just coordination when you're first starting to jump rope once you get the coordination down, that's where the cardio really comes in because you can go super fast. And that's how you can kind of bring your endurance to another level. But wherever you are in your journey, honor it, appreciate it. We gotta be grateful, we're healthy. We're able to do the thing, we're able to move our body. It's a blessing, it won't always be this way. The fact that you can do it now, tons of gratitude, right? All right, we're going back to that run in place. It's very similar to regular bounce, right? But we're just alternating weight back and forth between two legs. And then lifting them up a little bit more to try to replicate that running in place movement. But notice how my hands stay the same, right? You don't need to do anything crazy with your arms. Just keep the same regular balance form in your upper body. And it's the only thing that's different is your feet. Instead of lifting both of them at the same time, you're lifting one at a time.
Deep breath, relax. Enjoy this brief rest. All right, we're gonna go back to the feet front to back. So again, we're up on the balls of our feet. Just alternating weight back and forth. One foot in front of the other. The key also is keep your shoulder blades back and together. Good posture. You know, there's a lot of similarities between like good posture and all sports. Think about yoga, you know, that nice straight spine. Same thing here, jump rope. We don't want to hunch over. We don't want to be, don't want to be arching. Want that nice straight spine. Nice and bouncy. It's floating off one foot and then the other. Side to side, Just bring your balls of your feet together and back out to the sides. You can pick up the tempo a little more here. In the back half of this workout, we want to get our money's worth. Let's go. Put it there. Last 10 seconds. Finish strong. Next, your favorite, the double unders. Again, we're gonna do a few regular bounce, followed by double under. Stay in that rhythm. Same thing, you don't have to move your upper body a ton. Keep those hands down. Most people trip over the double under because they're lifting their hands up when they're doing double under. Keep your hands down by your waist. See a lot more room for the the rope to cycle onto your body. That's a little pro tip right there. Learned that one the hard way. You used to always do that, and then I was like, wait a minute. I just keep my hands on my hips. I don't have to jump so high. I don't have to try so hard. It's a lot easier. And I still mess up either way. Think about jump rope, right? Judgment free exercise. Don't judge ourselves, just honor ourselves for getting out of here and doing the thing. You should feel proud just the fact that you're putting in the work. A lot of people won't do it. The fact that you're doing it with me right now just says a lot about you. If you want a better life, you want more for yourself, you know you deserve it. So you're putting in that work. Regular bounce, let's go. We're almost done here. Not put it there, speed it up. Burning a little bit at this point. Maybe you feel your shoulders, your forearms, your calves, the front of your calves, your anterior tib, your feet. It means you're working hard. Relish it. Alright. Here we go, running 
please. Finish strong here. Get your full money's worth. You're out right, here doing it. Might as well get all you can from the workout. Push yourself here as you finish. All the way through the finish line. Sprint through the finish line. Halfway there. Beautiful. Last 15 seconds here. Reach your hands up over your head. Deep breath. Grab one out, uh, wrist, pull it over, open up your side body. Same thing other side. Thank the eternal source for another beautiful workout. Whatever you believe in, God, Allah, the universe. We're all here. We're healthy. We have a lot to be grateful for. So. Appreciate you for doing this workout with me today. If you haven't already subscribed to the YouTube channel, uh, drop any comments or questions you have below. We'll get those answered for you. As you notice, we answer all of our comments. Got your back. <laughs> and again, if you want this jump rope or the mat or anything here, you can check it out, linked in the description below. Again, my name is Brian Epstein. We are the Jump Rope Dudes. As always, do the thing.